Hello everybody, welcome back to Fallout 76. I'm gonna get a quick video to show you exactly how to respawn items inside of the game of Fallout 76. First thing you wanna do, well, I'm gonna explain to you how the, the game works. So, say in this, in this little trailer, there's 230 items in here, right? I come in here, I pick up all 230 items. I server hop, and they're still not spawned, right? They're not spawned. And if I were to go several more hours playing the game, not picking up any more items, these would still not spawn. This thing would be empty in every server I go to. So, in order to respawn them, every person is set with like a, an item table. So basically, once you pick up 277 or 255 items, your loot table will respawn. So if I pick 230 items up in here, all I'd have to do is come in here, pick up 20 more items, and then leave, and then join back, and then this whole thing will be full of items again. So, basically, it doesn't, like, reset until you've picked up, like, the items for it to reset. So, how you can apply this, you can apply this to anything. Say you're coming over to, uh, you can do it at White Springs. Say, okay. Say you go down to Lucky Hole Mine, you're farming lead, right? You hop on, you uh, throw your excavator arm, excavator power armor on, you go there, kill all the enemies, loot all the veins, and then you come over to a place that has 200 and something items in it, such as Summersville, uh, White Springs Golf Club, there's a couple other places that just have like a bunch of items, but basically you want to find a place that has items that you could pick up more than 200 items some people say you could pick up dirty water that doesn't work for me ever so basically what you want to do is for this example of this video we'll say that you are farming lead okay so you went to the place you farmed lead you picked up all the lead now in the same server you're going to go over to summersville and in summersville you want to fast travel there because as soon as you spawn in directly in front of you is going to be a house you're going to see it in just a second that house straight in front of me this is the place you want to go so after you've looted lucky hole mine and you fast traveled here while you're on the same server you want to come in here it's not going to spawn for me because sometimes it doesn't but basically there's going to be books scattered everywhere you want to pick up every single one of them you want to pick up all different loot items you want to pick up that you want to pick up bottles you want to pick up just items anything all of this pick all of it up Keep, go up here. There's going to be books scattered right here, in the shelves right there, on the couch. In here, they're going to be scattered all on these shelves, everywhere. Pick them all up, then leave. More bottles right here. And if this house, sometimes it doesn't spawn a full hundred and uh, two hundred and something items in it. So you can come over here. There's some items in this house. There's some items over here. Like, it doesn't matter. Just find the amount of items you need. Anything will count except for water right here great area to find a bunch of items battery clipboards desk fans anything like that pick it all up and then when you're done simply just leave the world and in order for you to figure out whether it worked or not when you spawn back in you'll spawn in front of that house run over there and if there's books in it that's good so then fast travel back to lucky hole mine and all of the veins should be respawned it's really crazy I, I've heard about this like this has been around since like the beginning of the game and I've always known about it But I've never tried it myself um, But now you know I'm gonna have to <laughs> to farm some of the junk items that I need Because on Xbox I just traded for all my junk items, but this time I'm actually trying to grind for it <sighs> So you basically run over here and You know, if the books are back, then that's that's good. Just run through here. Don't loot them again. As soon as you spawn in, don't loot them again. You come over here, and you see that they're spawned. Great. Now, you go back over to Lucky Hole Mine, or wherever place you're looting. This resets uh, items inside of buildings. This resets uh, items that are just scattered on the ground. This resets uh, magazines, uh, chems, anything like that. Uh, it respawns plants, it respawns um, veins, it respawns uh, those, uh, what 
those things called? It respawns the draw. The there's like these crashed satellites that you can find around the map. It respawns those. Um, it respawns everything. It just re completely resets your loot table. So, yeah, I knew I, I knew someone who farmed like 15k lead in just like an hour from Lucky Home Mine. So you guys can do it. It's crazy. But yeah, quick little video. This is gonna be necessity for like the coming junk videos that I'm posting, and you can use them for pretty much every single one. So yeah, peace out, guys.